Rise and shine, everyone. Welcome to the weekly vlog. It's Monday. It's 7 a.m. And we need to get into the day. Because I feel like going and working from the beach. <laughs> it's a nice day. And I want to take advantage of the weather. But I have some things to do before I actually leave the house. So, let's not waste time. I've had five hours sleep, so... I'm tired. I'm actually gonna take Franklin for a W. He is fast asleep though, like hasn't moved at all. And then I'll go gym. I need to walk in before it gets too hot. Hello, you heard me say the W word, didn't you? Good morning, oh you're so warm. <laughs> Hi Angel. Right, let's feed you. Good boy. <gasps> what the hell? All right, I'll come back to life when we're back. <laughs> I'm back, that was good. We just did about 40 minutes and it wasn't too hot, so I'm glad I did that. Frank, come here. Oh. How was your walk, buddy? Did you like that? Mommy's gonna go gym. I'm glad that I'm up and doing this early, even though I know this session is going to be hard because lack of sleep will do that to you. I'm so sweaty. I'm also someone that goes very red in the face. I'm glad I got it done now though. I just want to quickly go see if there's any strawberries on the plant outside. Hi, little man. The patch is, yeah, definitely thriving right now, which we love to see. Do I have any berries? <gasps> no. Oh, that's barely one. You know what? Frank can have that one right now. You want this one? You're welcome. Where's my berries? Okay. Looks like no strawbs for me today, everybody. <laughs> There'll be some more coming through here, maybe by the end of the week. Cucumbers. Little baby one over there. They're so cute. It would have been good with straws, but that's okay. I've got on pink bikinis. Today, what I need to get done is the planning for the two episodes I'm recording tomorrow, editing of Thursday's podcast and editing of the vlog, which I'm gonna do on the beach. <laughs> I'm actually filming some branded content first. So I'm gonna do that. And then I'll pack the lunch and we can head off. I'm taking King Franklin with me because he loves to go and he hasn't been all year. And I'm excited. Everything is packed in the back. I've got my work stuff. I've got his stuff. I've got the esky in the boot. And we're going to head down. We are here. I'm so happy. I'm glad I did this. I'm so grateful. I yeah it was just on the phone and i was saying like i feel so blessed that i can just come and work here and mum's here so she's gonna look after franklin for me and i'm really happy good boy you want to go in the water no his little ears such a beautiful day a little windy but still really lovely come on this way let's go and I'm calling it a day on work. I've been in the shade just because of my tattoos. I went and just had a quick dip. I don't want to get them in the sun. So I put on new Bipanthan, trying to keep them nice. These ones, yeah. Time to go home, buddy. Come on, let's go. He just did a wheeze. <laughs> All right, we are going home. It is 6 p.m., 10 past 6 actually, and I actually just needed to come here, hang out with mum. Carla was also here, and 
yeah, even though it wasn't like a usual beach day where like I'm fully swimming and you know being a mermaid, it was still really nice. I got all my work done, the vlog got up, the podcast planning got done. The only thing I didn't get a chance to do was Thursday's podcast, but I can do that when I get home right now or after I drive home. And this little guy is KO'd in the front seat. So I've cooled the car down, the AC was just on, I turned it off to film. <laughs> I've got it pumping again and I'll take him home. He's had his dinner too. I did not wet my hair, so I'm not gonna wash it. I might wash it in the morning. I'll see how it comes up tomorrow when I wake up, but I need to get showered because I feel sticky and I feel sandy. And you know, just that post-beach shower, it hits. Oh, you guys, I did the AMA tonight. Ask me anything over on Instagram. Finally back for the year. I've missed it so much. Had so many questions as well, but I got home at like 8 p.m. and I wanted to call it an early night because I gotta get up early tomorrow. But I, yeah, I missed it and I got so many cute questions and I'm happy to be back. Everything's like fully back now. I've also got King Frank here, his sleepy boy. I'm going to let him sleep with me because he's so cute and he had a big day and yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. Hi, darling. You look so sleepy. <laughs> it's definitely a little more fresh this morning we're going to the potty studio back to normal tuesday routine just for this week feb is going to be a little bit more messed up but that's okay <laughs> i'm definitely feeling tired i could have kept sleeping for like 20 hours truly but i've got to be at the podcast studio by nine so i've got sofa allen coming on she is my new coach and she is a certified PT. She's also a content creator. She's amazing and I'm very, very excited. And then I'll do the other episode by myself. Mm, much better. Fun fact, I was meant to also have a dentist appointment after work. And my dentist caught in sick. <laughs> Which I'm low-key terrified of the dentist, so I'm kind of happy. And I've also got a therapy appointment later too, so I was like, dentist and therapy in one day, I would have slept like a bloody baby. <laughs> the hair will be brushed out, time to pick a fit. I haven't made the bed because look, he has not moved. You alright buddy? He's so sleepy. I ended up going for this and I'm going to take another t-shirt to change into. And we're going to quickly have breakfast. Here's something I prepared earlier. to leave in six minutes. I'm so tired. <laughs> Maybe I can have a nap later. I'm gonna try and go to bed early tonight. We're in the studio, you guys. Sophie's here, we just had a coffee. I had a short black, that's my second coffee today. I think I've already got anxiety from it. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. What are we talking about? We are talking about health and fitness and Soph is a PT. She's my new coach as well. Ah, okay. <laughs> I've just gotten changed. I'm so upset. That entire time we recorded, there was fucking construction going next door. I feel like crying because like I couldn't concentrate and we like had to stop and start and stop and it's like full hammering they're like cutting into the concrete and i'm just having a bit of a meltdown <laughs> and now i have to record another episode and i'm not in a good headspace and i just feel bad because like obviously i had soph in here and she's like offered up her time i would have just like not recorded if it was just me um i'm really upset i've been holding it together this is going to be the thing that gives me a mental breakdown today we are done Thankfully, I have established today is just not my day. I'm accepting today is a flop day. Firstly, I got rejected from the rental that I inspected on Saturday. Secondly, that construction noise. We're gonna try and save the audio. I don't know if we're gonna be able to. I hope so. If if we can't, I'm just gonna can the episode because I don't want to put out shit a shit recording and I don't want to make so record again because I'm not doing that. Uh, and then I recorded a second episode. And there was no sounds there, but I just am not in a good headspace. Like today has just been like really 
testing me. So yeah, I just, I don't know if I can turn it around right now. I stopped at the servo. I don't know what I felt like, but I was like, you know what? I need a sweet treat because I do. And I love these. And maybe I am feeling a little bit better now that I have this. I've just come to grab some things for lunch and check the PO box and then we'll head home and eat. I am feeling a little bit better after having this. Nothing like a sweet treat. Oh. I'm so hungry, buddy. All right, I made it. I need to make lunch before I do anything further. Today, I finally tried the chopped sandwich where you pre-cut everything. I did make a more detailed TikTok about it. I don't like it at all. Everything falls out. It's a waste of time. It's a waste of mess. Do not recommend, zero out of 10. However, my feelings slap. I'm actually gonna go out on a limb and say, do not move back in with your parents. This is Thursday's episode. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Em's on it if you can't tell. He is so sleepy. I think the beach Took it out of him yesterday. <laughs> and now I have my therapy appointment. I'm gonna do it in here. I was gonna go for a walk, but I think it might be a bit too warm. So I'm just gonna stay in here and then I'll walk after I finish up work. Therapy was good. I've got a load of washing on. I'm feeling quite exhausted after that. It's nice because we really got to the bottom of some things today. I've been feeling all sorts of fucked up. And I couldn't figure out <laughs> what the trigger was or what the root cause was, but I figured it out today. Which is good because it gives me some peace. Doesn't get rid of it yet, but at least now I have a clearer path. I fell asleep. <laughs> my eyes were like closing up my computer. It was like 6.30 p.m. and then I laid on my bed and I fell asleep and I've woken up and it's 7.30. And I thought it was 7.30 a.m. Tomorrow. <laughs> I feel cooked. Anyway, I'm hanging my clothes. He has not moved again, guys. What have I done to him? The beach must have taken it out of you, buddy. I'm gonna let him sleep with me again. Desperately, we'll need to sort this out tomorrow because it's giving disheveled and I need to go to bed. While I was watering Carla's garden, there were bees everywhere. So many bees, like 10, 20 bees. And I've never seen that many bees there. I'm like, is there a hive starting? I hope the fuck not. She's away and so is my mum. And yeah, that's a little update. I have his Udi there, he's still in the pillows and I think he might stay there. We'll see you guys in the morning. No kiss for me. <laughs> Happy Wednesday. I finally woke up feeling a bit better. Yesterday was honestly testing my patience everyone. <sighs> Not shown is that all of the TikTok videos I posted yesterday in the late afternoon all went under review for so long. And I was like, why? I didn't do anything bad in them. I didn't, like, I, I'm a pretty, like, PG creator. <laughs> Why was it under review? Anyway, they all went up in the night when I was asleep. Fire out. And it was just, like, cherry on top of the icing. The straw that broke the camel's back. <laughs> Today, I've got gym, meetings, filming two brand deals, inspections. I have to say, I'm very grateful, very grateful that I can go to these inspections later in the afternoon because they're in business hours. And I don't know why real estate agents do that. Like, what about other people that can't bloody get to that inspection? I feel like it's a bit stupid. I've also got a giant bed bug. His name is Franklin and he is not leaving my bed. <laughs> I really want to try and also have an early night tonight just because... My shitty sleep schedule is doing a number on me. I didn't take you guys to the gym, but I'm back home now. My workout was good. I'm just having some breakfast 
and I'm about to log into my first meeting of the day with Miss Emily. It's like our monthly, our fortnightly work in progress. Okay, one meeting down, another one to go. This is a podcast meeting. Oh, I look so bad. I need to have a shower and sort out my face. Hi! All right, buddy. Meetings are done. It's time. We got to change the sheets. I know, I know, mummy's doing things on your bed. How dare she? <laughs> And then I need to have a shower. All right, we don't need to do grooming right now. Not while we're on camera. Oh my, oh, sweetie. I love you. All right, come on. <laughs> Mommy has to pick you up. Come on, let's go. I'll show you something out here. Come on, pick. <gasps> yeah, what is it? Good boy, come. No one is here guys, but I have to get him off the bed. Quickly come to get a roll. I'll be right back. I must have sold out the sea salt one. No, it probably wasn't me, but the sea salt one is sold out. So I got the herbed one. Hopefully it's yummy. Today's combo. I think the bread is actually too small today. Mm. Franklin. <laughs> The branded content that I filmed today was for Elite 11. I did that this morning in the gym. And then I'm filming another batch of content now for Petal and Pup, which that'll be my third time working with them. I'm so excited and so happy. How have I parted my hair? Why does that look weird? Mm. And then we'll head to the inspection after that. With this one, I don't necessarily love it, but I need to keep going. I need to keep the momentum. I need to keep the showing the universe that I'm taking action. <laughs> All of the content has just been shot. I will edit it and then we will head off. I wish I could bring Franklin with me. <laughs> I hung my clothes out on the line too. It ended up being such a nice day. So hopefully they'll be dry by the time I get back and then we can make this bed. I'm also going to show you what happens when I film <laughs> behind the scenes. A bit of a mess over here. I have the ironing board in the hallway because I was ironing the clothes. I didn't want them to be creased in my hall that I filmed. So I'm gonna pop that away and then we'll head off. All right, the inspection is done. I did like it. That's probably in first place now because I didn't apply for any that I went to on Saturday and I am going to, I'm not sure if I'm gonna apply for this one or not. I'll decide by the time I get home. <laughs> Oh, I love a good weather day like today because these just dried so quickly. I'm going to quickly make the bed. And I don't think I'm going to apply for that one. Just too many things on the con list. After this, shower, put my PJs on and try and have an early night because I'm really tired these last few days. Like more tired than usual. I'm having a gym girl dinner. I'm having broccolini, potatoes and a piece of steak. Quick and easy. I'm getting in some veggies. I'm probably going to eat all of these. I had to do my greens and I've cooked these medium rare. You can see like the blood kind of pooling there. That's how I know it's cooked ready or cooked to the way that I like it. And I'm going to grab a Sprite. The urge to get Uber Eats, so real. The exhaust fan is still on. Cooked beautifully. I hate this knife. Mm. Yum. So good. Oh, hey, buddy. You want some? Part of me is like tempted to watch maths, but then I'm like, don't start. There's too many things in my brain to commit to that. And I'm gonna do a tiny bit of admin work. I've got to make some selections, order some things. 
for a campaign and I'm also going to look on realestate.com. My best friend. It is like dating, you know when you like swipe on Hinge? <laughs> I desperately need to get to Mecca and buy a new bronzer and some skincare and do a little top up. I think it might be beauty loop time as well. I'm not sure. But I was just thinking, I need to go. I don't know if I'll have time in this vlog. I also need to organize the giveaway. My brain's on like overdrive and I've been thinking about the rental that I went to see. I had to write down a pros and cons list and go through it and like rate everything to like be calm with my decision. The cons, there were three things on the cons list, 20 things on the pros list, but the cons list had more weight to it. So I'm at peace with the non-application. This evening, Mr. Franklin also had a bath and he had his nails trimmed. He had a little spa treatment by me and I gave him a carrot because he loves them. And we're going to say goodnight. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. No gym. We're going to go for a... I'm quite sore from the gym yesterday. So, it's a rest. I'm still so tired. Oh, where are you? Oh, sorry. I just... Break your man, I didn't see you. Hi, Angel. How is your sleep? Are you hungry? Here you go. Oh, yeah. Pinch punch. First day of the month. I'm a bit scared for February, you guys. There's a lot of moving parts for me. I'm assuming multiple Menti Bs. <laughs> but for real, if you want to do some journaling today or this week, there's going to be journal prompts in the Your Safe Space Facebook community. The link to that is in the notes as well. I do monthly prompts there and also on the Instagram, but I just post it on the story on the Instagram. So it runs out and goes away. Yeah. I realized I have rotated like the same few sets of activewear. The one with the halter bra, because that is truly my most favorite one. I feel like it holds the girls nicely. But I was like, I need to start rotating more. Franklin, come here, we're going for a walk. Oh, look at that today. Look at that today. Oh, someone's excited. All right, mommy has to clip you, wait. Good boy. Good job. That was good today. Let's go. We're back. I ended up putting on a puffer because the sun disappeared and it's turned into like a really cloudy day. But by the end of it, I had to take it off because I was sweaty. Did you like that, buddy? Did you have a good time? Mwah. Now this morning, in literally a minute, I'm gonna leave. I need to go get this touched up. It's ever, ever so slightly. Just the tip of this heart is not connected. There's like a tiny, I don't even know if you can see it on the camera, like a tiny, tiny dot missing. Can you kind of see it there? I'm being a little bit pedantic, but it's a fine line tattoo and it's gonna be on me forever. So <laughs> Sam said that she would fix it for me this morning. And then straight after the tattoo touch up, I'm going to get acai with one of my friends named Kat. And it's like our first time hanging out and I'm so excited because she's a internet friend. And yeah, I'm just happy that I get to like make a new connection this morning. All right, I'm here. And I actually made it right on time as well. Okay, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's literally the dot right in the middle of the heart. I'm gonna put a before and after picture on the screen just so you can see it. And now it's happy. <laughs> I'm now at Loverbowl, cause that's where we're going for acai this morning. Low key, I should have bought Bepanthan with me because this little dot is stinging and hurting me and I just needs to be soothed a little. Anyway, I am not gonna vlog. I will come back when I'm done. I'm back home. Acai with cat was so good. I actually preferred that experience at Lover Bowl 
like the taste was different of the bowl today compared to the last time I went with Claire. Anyway, my tattoo is fine now. It just must have been stinging as well because I only got it done last week. So the skin around it was probably a bit like ouchy anyway. But I'm still putting the panther on and now I am doing work. So I went past the shop to get a bread roll on my way home. Wait, I need to wash my hands. And today I'm editing Sunday's podcast. I'm also planning out next week's episodes because I'm recording in Sydney. And I've got a very special guest, a very, very special guest. And I can't wait for you guys to see who it is. King Frank in his usual spot. So I'm just editing the Sunday pod and I sound like I'm about to cry in it. <laughs> I knew that I was not in a good headspace and you would have even seen in the vlog between the two episodes, I was trying to like pull myself together, but I didn't realize you could hear it so clearly. <laughs> I'm only two minutes in, so hopefully by the end of it, which it's a 38 minute episode, I was still able to talk for 38 minutes, so that's a good sign. But I just hope it's a little bit more. I hope I come good, because I don't have time to re-record this. It's Thursday and this comes out on Sunday. Don't worry, I come good by six minutes. <laughs> Something ha must have happened between the taking up space and me starting the topic. I think I spoke about Taylor Swift and then it shifted my mood. <laughs> I tried a whole different filling today. I did a tuna melt and I toasted the bread. It is so good. 10 out of 10. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Just so messy. But yum. I need to show you guys my new jammies. So I did an order, purchased myself from the brand Samail. I think that's how you say it. Anyway, how to use the packaging. There's a pair in there for Suzanne because I got her a pair. I don't think she watches my vlog, so I can show you guys. But look, they've got little red hearts everywhere. And I got shorts and I got Suze and I matching. So I'm really, really stoked and how cute is this? She, thank you so much for supporting us. I'm delicate, please cold wash only. And <laughs> I'm seeing Suze tomorrow night. So I'm gonna give her her pair. Look at the garden hall. I just watered everything and I thought I need to harvest it because they'll go bad if I leave them out there for too much longer. I'm gonna have to make something with tomatoes. I'm also quite hot and sweaty after that. <laughs> Maybe like a pasta with the tomatoes. Not tonight. I'm, right now I feel like ordering Uber Eats. Right now I'm not that hungry. I don't know what I'm going to do for dinner. I could make my other steak. Oh, I don't like being an adult. I got a bacon deluxe burger. I don't want to hear it. Okay. And I did use Uber Eats. the inspections that I had today I didn't go ahead because they said they'd already been leased and I got texts about them this morning I'm just feeling disheartened and then I was like fuck should I have just applied for yesterday's one even though it wasn't like a hundred percent yes and then I remembered it's only been a week <laughs> hang in there good night you guys I've got a little I think hormonal pimple generally the ones on your chin are hormonal anyway <laughs> i'm putting on a pimple patch and it's my last one so i'm gonna have to go and buy a new packet tomorrow from Camus warehouse these are honestly 10 out of 10. sweetest dreams i'll see you in the morning happy friday i'm so proud of myself because i went to bed around 11 which was probably the earliest i've gone all week and I actually fell asleep. So I woke up okay this morning, like not feeling like I should sleep more or could sleep more. And it's one of the first like proper nights. I've had a few like decent, like uninterrupted sleeps this week, but like that felt, ugh, I feel ready for today. Mm, I feel good. And as usual, we are starting our day with a workout. 
slow buddy day. I say yes, even though they really like tank me, <laughs> but I love a good sweaty workout. Still got my pimple patch. <laughs> anyway, I have the best leg and ass pump, and I'm gonna show you when I get up. <laughs> Little quad pump. I'm here for it. That's honestly my favorite leg day. I've after three weeks of this program, I'm so happy that that's the one. Hi Tim. Good morning. How are you? I'm good, thanks. My name's Adele. I'm just calling because I saw your property. So I'm trying this tactic of calling the agent when I see the property that I like and applying before I even go and inspect it. Apparently that's going to work. Some people also told me to not say that I had Franklin. I don't think that's going to work because on your application you have to write down what you do for work. So I put down that I'm a content creator and podcast host. Most people will go and Google that and I'll come up and they'll see Franklin. So then I never want a landlord to think that I'm a liar and that I'm being dishonest about having a dog. So I think it's better that I be upfront. I'm also adding in a cover letter to my applications now and just trying to kind of butter up the agent and hopefully, yeah, get somewhere because I've not had a good run this week and I'm gonna line up some inspections tomorrow. It's gonna be a really, really hot day too, so. I'll take you guys along, but yeah, fingers crossed we get somewhere. I need to do a little shop just because we need bits and pieces, so I'll quickly do that. Quick haul, I just got some yogurts, blackberries, deodorant, and tissues. <laughs> I had to bite it in half for him because it's too big. There you go, sweetie. So yummy, my favorite right now. of the day I'm trying to make sure that I'm in the KFC drive through to film this mukbang by 12 30 because I feel like that's prime time to make sure I'm getting a decent order and so glad I did my lower body session because I'm hungry today so hungry <laughs> I'm doing a full face as well because later after I finish work for the day I'm going to see Sue's we're gonna have a quick dinner and I wanna give her her Valentine's Day present. I'll wrap that as well before we go. And then I will see the man's after that. So I wanna look cute. It is too much. I desperately, desperately need to go and get a bronzer. I cannot keep using these three little pieces, honestly. If I do not go tomorrow, someone, please tell me. Tell me off, no, I'm gonna go tomorrow. And then while I'm there getting the bronzer at Mecca, I can sort out and give away for a hundred K because that's on my list as well. Oh my God, this is so humbling and miserable that I'm doing this. Adele be for real. You guys are the best. I put up a question box on my story. I said, funny, juicy, random, and you have come through. So I'm going to just filter through those, pick the most asked, and then we'll jump in the car and off we will go. We have a slight delay to the recording today or the filming. Baker's Delight just Uber Eats so much bread to my house. One, two, three, four. These hot crust buns, I just ate one. Five, I shouldn't have eaten one knowing that I'm about to film the mook bun. Six, seven, and a note that says, have a great day. Does anyone want some bread? I'm gonna share this with my neighbors and I'm gonna make sure that it doesn't go to waste because I'm not actually making a roll today and I wish that I was so I could use one, but I'll make sure that it gets used. Oh, I just finished and I'm in a 
food coma. I'm ready to like, ugh. but we have things to do. So let's do those things. I think that tactic worked because I've now got a private inspection for one of the units and the agent called me back and the agent, like he has been really lovely to me. So that's not going to be till next week. I'm still going to go to the ones tomorrow, but I'm like, wow, that's the first time that an agent has called me specifically. It's always been me being the annoying squeaky wheel. <sighs> okay. I need to do another quick edit of something to send to M and then we need to go to the shop because I've got to do some errands. I've got to post something, I've got to check the PO box and I've got to buy something else. Earlier, I also picked up this little pink Valentine's Day gift bag for Sue's. And then I also got her this card. How cute is it? Cause that's me and her. You're like a rainbow, but human. And it says, everything's just happier when you're around. So I'm gonna write in that. I've also got the podcast ready for Sunday. That's done. All the social clips are done. I've just got to do the, what am I trying to say? The thing that I post in the group and on the Instagram. I want to try and draw like flames around. Oh my God, that's so bad. <laughs> the fuck I don't get it together. Okay, I just returned what I needed to return. And from the PO box, I picked up a parcel from Bobby Brown. Can you see that? And then I got an empty box for my giveaway because that's what I'm doing. <laughs> and I've got to go buy something else. I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. So I bought my beads for my friendship bracelets for the Eros Tour. I also got a PR from Bobby Brown. It's their cleansing oil. And they sent me the cutest little, you know, when you wash your face in the basin? I'll even use that when I'm doing my makeup. Love that. And then I was on the hunt for a black robe for a special photo shoot next week, but I didn't have one. So I checked cotton on, I checked bras and things, I checked Kmart, so I'm gonna have to buy one online. It is dinner time. I'm at Hunky Dory, gonna go meet Sue. I actually just finally got hungry post KFC. And I'm gonna take her her goodies. I'm so tired, you guys. Very wholesome Friday night. And I need to get into bed because we got an early morning, an early day of inspection. So I'm gonna say good night. I'm gonna have a shower and I'll see you tomorrow. Hello. <laughs> Come on, up you get. Come on, let's go. You hungry? Oh, that'll do it. <laughs> that'll do it. <laughs> oh my god, I love you so much. Hi. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Good morning. Alright. <laughs> it's going to be a hot day today, so I have to take little Franklin early. Also, I wish I was at the beach instead. However, we have missions to run. <laughs> we just have inspections. I've got three today. And I will be going to every single one of them. I'm not going to do what I did last week. That was slack behavior. Just not good enough. You know, not going to two because I thought I was going to get the first one. Be for real. So, yeah, I've got three lined up today and now one on Monday. I'm pretty keen about the one on Monday. That's probably in like first place. The three I'm going to today, two are really promising. One is beautiful, but the location is a little bit um, of a worry for me. So I'm just gonna go see it anyway. I'm tired though, I could have kept sleeping and definitely need a rest. My body is so sore from the gym yesterday. What's the date today? It's fine. <laughs> It's 11th of Feb. I was like, what? It's, there's no way it's the 11th of Feb now. It's the 3rd, I think. Is it the 3rd? Yeah.
Yum. My hair needs a wash, but I'm gonna save that for tomorrow. A like a day event thing. So I want to look cute for that. And I thought there was something I had to do on my calendar, and I just had a heart attack. But it says tomorrow. <laughs> I have content scheduled to go live for a brand so I do not forget and I was like wait why is that showing up today oh, I'm getting a pedicure later too and I can't wait would you like to go for a walk oh, <laughs> did you guys see that what the hell we are like aligned as fuck today yeah we are all right let's go let's go <laughs> I'm awake now I'm gonna quickly eat shower and then we're gonna jump in the car wish I was going to the beach today however you know what at least I got to go on Monday and that was what I needed perfect how was your walk did you like it I'm gonna wear this today simply because it's gonna be hot and I still think this is like cute and appropriate I'm also going out later so I'm not gonna do makeup now and I'll curl my hair later too so we will not be putting heat on it now either. Oh, I've got a hair appointment next week and I cannot wait. I just feel, I feel like I need it. I've also noticed my hair getting super oily since I washed it so like consecutively around that time when I was doing like the AO. So I think I've trained my hair to be oily. <laughs> I'm at the first inspection you guys. I will see you shortly. Wish me luck. Okay, the first inspection is done. I will not be applying for that one just simply because it is far too big for one person and it was within my budget, but I'm just like, I don't need that much space. I also think that's more space to clean. That's more space to fill. I can't be bothered. I've now driven to the second one. So I'm about to run in. These were pretty much back to back, not literally, but like I had to get in the car I had to be quick there, get in the car, drive here. So Wish me luck again. Inspection number two is done. I won't be applying for that one either. And I'm just in the car waiting for inspection number three. Feeling a little disheartened, but all I keep thinking about is the inspection I went to earlier in the week and if I should have applied for that. But I know, yeah, I like I'm having scarcity mindset, which I don't like because I never have scarcity mindset. So I need to just like stay and tell myself, trust the process, trust the process, something will come. All inspections are now complete. It is midday and I am going to get my pedicure and then I'm going to make a nice fat sanger because <laughs> I'm hungry. I'm so hungry. It's not even funny. My stomach is like rumbling loudly and I don't know how I'm going to get a pedicure. I'm going to be like, please ignore my tummy. It's making all sorts of fucked up noises. Oh, I'm so hungry. I need a sea salt roll as well. With all of that bread yesterday, we actually had some family take it some of it went to my grandparents some of it went to my neighbors the rest in the freezer so i really want a sea salt roll that's why i'm gonna go buy a sea salt roll right after this petty is all done i also went past northland did some shopping for myself to make myself feel better and shopping for the giveaway and now I'm just quickly grabbing a bread roll. The universe really said you have bread at home because they were sold out of the sea salt panini <laughs> or the Turkish bread. Anyway I'm in the process of making a TikTok about this one. This is a followers comment so I'm curious to try it. Okay so this does definitely hit. I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. It's just I needed the other bread. However less waste so not a bad thing. Someone's hot and bothered and tired and sleepy. Which one of it of us is it? Both. <laughs> Love you, buddy. Franklin and I just fell asleep on my bed for an hour. What the hell? I'm gonna show you what I got from the shop as well. I need to like get ready because I'm going out tonight. <laughs> Can't wait to get home and put a pimple patch on because it needs it. However, I am doing makeup because I'm going to have a little girls night with Diana. We're going to go get tacos and mugs. I'll probably only have one because I'm not a big drinker and I need to wake up 
early tomorrow because I've got man's friend's birthday and I want to go to the gym before that and yeah it's just a busy weekend anyway my hair is giving yuck so I'm contemplating do I just put it up or do I try and curl it knowing that it'll be washed in the morning what are you doing buddy It sounds so saucy. It was just in Carla's room. I'm ready. So, here is the vibe. I opted to curl my hair. Loki regretting because it's so effing hot right now. But let's head off. Both last night and tonight when I got home, I remembered I have to water the garden. And both nights I've gotten home at like close to midnight. It's 11.45. Of course, my phone's not showing you right now. Oh, there we go. I got mauled by mozzies. Like my legs are so itchy. Fuck. Even here, can you see here? I just got attacked. Anyway, I'm gonna say goodnight. I'll see you guys in the morning. I've got an early start, so I need to get to bed. <laughs> Sweet dreams. I don't even have time to go to the gym this morning. I'm gonna try and go later. It's 20 past seven. I gotta leave here at nine, 10. <laughs> I can see you. I'm alive now, I've had a coffee. If I was gonna go to the gym this morning, I would have had to have woken up at like six, 5.30 a.m. on a Sunday. No. <laughs> it's already like nearly 30 degrees and it's I'm sweating. <laughs> I should have washed it last night. But again, I was tired at midnight. <sighs> I'm also getting my hair dyed on Wednesday, so I'm doing creatine. Alright, now we wait. Time check, 8.31. My makeup has come out. I had to spray the setting spray twice and I'm just waiting for it to dry so I can do my mascara and then I'm going to straighten my hair I was also just thinking how sweet it is that his friends make me feel so like welcome and yeah it's just really nice like I don't think I've ever really had that with anyone else I've dated in the past where they've just so been so willing to just like take me in which I think is really sweet and I was like fuck like I want to do the same in return but I haven't really had anything that I could be like all my friends are here like come do you know what i mean so i don't know just having some morning thoughts <laughs> and i'm going to wear this dress it was part of my pedal and pop collab this week which will go live maybe the next hour or two on tiktok and this just looks really cute on let me show you it was either this or you know that black set from princess polly but i'm like i can't wear black on a bloody 33 degree day to a day event slash day party it's at like this it's at the commons it's like that florally gardeny place so i think this is cute it's actually quite long i don't know if i'm gonna do heels or not but like see how long it is like it's <laughs> she long <laughs> all right so i've gone for gold accessories and i'm gonna wear these because i think they're like fitting the vibe and then i did get this bag from petal and pop and i don't know what i should do because like this is the whole bag and then you put your like crap in there that's from there so i could like take that but i'm like is that giving like beach vibe whereas if i just hold it it's probably better all right i'll see you guys later i am not gonna obviously vlog and i'll be back soon you guys i'm home i missed you it was hot it was really hot and I love the place that we went to. It's called The Commons. I've never been there, but it was this beautiful garden, like out in the open, kind of really floral, feminine, really cute for like a hens even, or a birthday. It was a 30th today. And we were there from like 11 till about three. And then we just were at one of his friend's houses and I've just come home now, it's about 5.30ish. I've missed you, poor baby. I've left him all day. But you haven't been by yourself so it's okay but it's really hot here and 
he's fine in the heat. Like we have to keep him out of the sun because if he had his, his choice, he would sit in the sun all day. But I need to like just come good and maybe have a shower and freshen up because I'm feeling a bit sweaty and not the best right now. Uh, I look okay, like kind of, I think, but far out, I feel. I wanted to give you a quick look into the giveaway. So I did put a gift card in just because I thought someone can buy what they want. But then I have a whole heap of products that I love and use. A tiny bit of PR is in here. I did buy most of it. I've got one of my favorite books, Ikigai. Everyone should read that book, honestly. <laughs> I also have some skincare. I've got lip balm. I've got these pills, a beautiful candle, the eye mask that I love. I've got some Kosas. I even have my setting spray in there. I just wanted someone to try it out, a little bit of Rare Beauty. And is that all? Yes, I think that's everything. Anyway, this will be live over on my Instagram. So if you want to go and enter, please be my guest. And then I did buy myself these yesterday too. I finally got a new bronzer. I'm low-key worried that it's different because that's what it used to look like and this is what it looks like now. I don't know if this is the right one and I, it's really hard to open. Anyway, it looks beautiful nonetheless. Picked up the Summer Fridays lip oil and I've got it on right now and I'm a big, big fan. I was influenced. I saw a creator, Peyton, and I love her and she posted about it and I immediately ran to Mecca. And then I finally got my pimple patches. I'm eating some Sour Patch Kids, but we have to do the joy jar. I didn't forget. <laughs> it was in my calendar. So I want you to think what you think my joy is, and then I'll show you. And I can't believe it's week five because we're into February. I'm also going to use a yellow one because we haven't got yellow in the jar yet. See? <laughs> All right. Keep thinking. I'll show you it in a second. All right. My joy for the week is Baker's Delight sending me PR and sandwich talk because my sandwich TikToks have been going crazy and the comments from you guys are incredible and I'm loving that I'm inspiring seeing all your combinations and it's just been something that's kept me going this week when I haven't really felt like it. So love you guys and love you Baker's Delight and I still can't believe this happened. I just took my jewelry off because I'm about to have a shower. I don't know if I told you guys but I did put this on me today. I mean... I'm obviously a bit sweaty because I'm standing in direct sunlight, but I think it did give me a little bit of a glisten and make me look cute in pics and videos today. So I really like this and I love the smell of it too. Very happy. Do you know how good I feel after that shower? I'm going to have to have another one before I get into bed because I'm already sweaty. Like it's already hot in here and the cool change is not coming for ages, but I did my skin here and I feel so good. I really wanted to wash my hair again, but I just thought... If I dry it, it's just going to be sweaty again. So I'm going to have to wash my hair in the morning. And I didn't want to put on pajamas yet. So I just put on this top. It's fully backless so I can breathe. And I just got a denim skirt on. I'm not going anywhere, but I'm just like comfort. And not pajama time yet. I missed you today. So much. On the menu tonight is chicken schnitzel. And I made this salad just now. I used tomato from the garden, basil from the garden, and my cheese from yesterday, my sandwich. I'm gonna probably eat this whole thing because look at how good that looks. I just did salt, pepper, and olive oil. Mwah. So, so yummy. The only thing that would make this better truly is <laughs> that sea salt bread. Because I tell you, it's so bloody delicious. Well, 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 I did not want to water the garden at midnight again, so I thought I'll do it now. It's eight o'clock and I am hot after that. I'm also having my dessert. I really wanted an ice cream, but we have none. And I think it's time to wrap the vlog. What do you reckon? I can't give you this. It's got chalk chip. Guys, it's been a week. I'm no closer to finding a home for Franklin and I. Please keep us in your thoughts. I have had my cup filled with social stuff this weekend as well, which has been really nice. I also have a really busy week coming up, so that's why I'm going to wrap it early. I'll wrap this video early-ish because I need to mentally prepare and you'll see everything in this coming week. 
And what else did I need to update you on? I can't even think. I didn't even get to the gym today. Not very good of me. It's too hot. There's not a chance in hell I was going now. I cannot wait for the cool change. I'll have to do my last session tomorrow. Anyway, good night. Thank you so much for spending another week with me. Thank you for supporting me. A special thank you if you've also sent me a sweet message, left me a sweet comment. I see them all and I probably need that now more than ever. So just so you know how much it truly means. <clears throat> I'm choking on the tiny teddy. I do love you guys and I'm really grateful and I hope you know that every day I think that. And yeah, I just will forever be grateful for you all. Anyway, bye from us. You want to say goodbye? Bye, guys.